Mayor of New Bedford thinks the MBTA trains could finally be running uh, between his city and Boston by late this year after another delay in the South Coast Rail Project. Target 12 investigator and the host of Newsmakers, Tim White, is here now with the latest. New Bedford Mayor John Mitchell says transportation officials are now telling him South Coast Rail should start moving passengers by the fall, but says even that timeline is uncertain. The much anticipated South Coast Rail project was set to be operational by the summer, but is again being pushed back. My understanding is the fall, whenever that is. I don't know if that means Labor Day or when the leaves start to turn. New Bedford Mayor John Mitchell says NBTA leaders need to firm up the timeline for the good of the region. What I would say is they have to pick a date, though, and publicly announce it. Um, because, like with any project, the projects move ahead when there are hard deadlines that everybody has to work toward. Once it starts operating, the so called Phase 1 of the South Coast Rail project will send trains up to East Taunton, then detour them to hook up with the existing. Middleborough Lakeville line, which carries passengers to Boston. The estimated travel time, 90 minutes. It's not, to my mind, not the end all be all. Be all. Phase two of South Coast Rail would be a more direct shot and cost billions more, but it's still on the drawing board. Do you think that's actually ever going to happen? It, it, it could. I'm not holding my breath. Mitchell warns South Coast Rail is no silver bullet. My concern is that we will go back, whenever that starts to happen, we'll go back to the approach to economic development in New Bedford, which is, oh, let's just build this direct line to Boston when there's a whole lot of other things that we should be focusing on. Fall Rivers mayor has indicated the latest holdup with South Coast Rail is a problem with a switching station in East Taunton. Mitchell says safety has to come first. Tim White, 12 News.